Hey there, Brad Smith here, owner of Automation Links. Thank you so much for checking out the Million Dollar Sales Funnel. I'm really excited about this program. Some of our clients are seeing amazing results with this. And it's just really cool to see uh, all the different funnels and systems come into place to really help you all grow your business. And I want to show you our highest converting sales funnel here. This has been amazing. And if you stick with me to the end, I'll give you our top four converting sales funnels, the appointment funnel, the e-commerce funnel, the checkout page funnel, which I'll talk about shortly, and the email marketing funnel. These are really good systems to put in place for any type of business out there to increase sales. And if you're on YouTube right now, um, please subscribe. That would be awesome so I can keep sending you our latest sales funnels that are working well. So this sales funnel here, you know, a lot of times people start the marketing and the ads before actually having a good system in place. And this is where, you know, a lot of feedback that I get is, hey, my marketing's not working or what I've been doing is just not working. Well, the system needs to be in place to take a cold buyer to a warm buyer to a hot buyer. Now, if you haven't heard me say that before, when you start doing marketing and ads, most likely you're accidentally getting to the cold buyers. Now, when those cold buyers get into your website, they just leave. The average website gets a 1% conversion rate. If you do it right and you set up a sale, you can get as high as a 17, seven to 15% conversion rate. So instead of one out of a thousand signing up on your website, you're gonna get seven to 15 signing up, which will give you the opportunity to turn them from a cold buyer to a warm, to a hot buyer. So here's an example sales funnel that's working really well for some of our clients. Um, and even if you're a lead-based, appointment-based uh, client, this can work for you. And I will give you access to this at the end of this video for you to get this whole folder I'm going to give you the sales funnel, all the bullet points we'll cover today, and even the email sequence that we talk about. So step number one is how to get more customers. And this is where most of you have already tried the Google, the marketing, the social media. But this actually is meant for the end. So don't do this yet. We have to have the system in place. We'll come back to this. The system needs to be made first in order to get the marketing, make sure the marketing works and helps you get more sales or else you're just gonna be spinning your wheels and spending a ton of money on marketing and ads or time on marketing and not get the results you were hoping for, which most people come to us saying, we tried marketing on our own, it didn't work. What happened? And the first question is, what link were you sending them to? And the first response is our website. So that's number one mistake. So how can you get more conversions, higher conversion rates? So the number one way that's working right now is to set up a separate landing page that's different than your website. I want you to, you can keep the same branding and keep the same look and feel of your website, but you have to give them your best offer here on this landing page in exchange for the email. What that does is it gives them the best offer as a bribe to get them onto your website or landing pages and get them on your email list. So here's an example. This is a website that it looks just like their website, right? But the only place that they can go is to fill out this form. So in exchange for their name and email, we're going to give them 10%. That's called a bribe in order to give them our best offer. Another thing on this landing page is we build relationships. We build trust with other things that you can, that your clients can recognize. Like if you're featured on Forbes, but that you're featured on Forbes, tell them exactly what to do. A three-step process. This is what's going to happen. One, two, three, show them your product, show them your services, give them the best offer again. Show them reviews, give them your best offer again. They can't go anywhere. Everything is right on this landing page. They can't go to your website and get lost. They're stuck here in exchange for their name and email. What that does, it adds them into your email marketing list, which we'll talk about, to, so you can build a better relationship. Take them from cold to warm to hot where they pay. And that's really the thing we wanna focus on when it comes to any type of marketing. And if you wanna increase your results, you have to have the system in place. So that's that. Here's another example. This client here, this may be better for a lead-based business where they can watch a webinar or get a free demo. They can't go anywhere. They're stuck on this page about the business, a video to build relationship, reviews, logos to build trust, four-step process is what you should expect, more reviews, and guess what? Only place you can go is to sign up for the webinar. And what that does is it adds them in that email marketing follow-up so you can turn them from a cold buyer 
to a warm buyer to a hot buyer. Now that land, last landing page is getting about 2000 leads a month. Imagine if you're getting 2000 leads a month, it's because their conversion rate is 15%. They didn't have to spend more on ads. They actually got to, they're spending less on ads and they're getting more leads because they have that very specific landing page that builds relationships and gets them on the list. Next, we wanna talk about what's your best offer. What's the best offer you can offer them? You wanna put your best offer on this page. This business right here is you know, scaled and grown tremendously just by offering a 10% discount. It's not really gonna hurt your bottom line if you give a first customer 10%. And then what that does is gets them on your list so you can start following up with them. What's your best offer here? This is the normal gym offer, seven day free trial, but they can't go to the website unless they fill out this info and get on the list, right? So I want you to think about how you can build better relationships with your clients. All right, next is what's your offer? So your offer could be really whatever you can afford to give them, the more the better. The more, if you can give them 20%, give them 20%. If you can give them 50% off, give them 50% off. That's really the key. You're gonna get more emails, the better your offer. Now, the reason we put it on the landing page separate than your website is it has to load fast. That was another reason why that last business is getting 2,000 leads a month and their costs went down because it loads so fast. Google, when a new lead comes from any of those systems, it loads fast and that those systems and software recognize it and they're gonna give you a better quality score. Now, this is a whole different um, video for this, but higher your quality score, the less you pay. So you wanna build your landing pages on a separate software that loads within a second. It's gonna also make your customers happy. It's gonna be easy to give their name and email and get on your list, right? And then we wanna talk about checkout pages. So when they come to this funnel, they're gonna land on your landing page and see your best offer, right? Then we're gonna give them that coupon code, give them that offer, and then they can buy it on this order page. Now, if your order page looks like crap and doesn't look like an Amazon checkout page, which we'll talk about in a minute, they're most likely gonna leave. So you can actually give them that product, that pricing, let them buy right away. You don't have to trick them, just send them, give them the coupon, give them your best offer and let them buy. Most people won't unless they're a warm or hot audience. So you wanna have this here just in case a warm or hot customer comes back to your landing page, get them in that checkout and let them buy from you, get them on the follow-up system. But what we want is this checkout page to look really cool. We don't want a lame checkout page. Here's a good example of a client we work with. Um, it looks like an Amazon checkout page. They've got the pictures on the left, main picture here, 20% discount code, give them all the different options, give them the ground, add to cart, it's gonna bring up this really cool pop-up. And this is what I talk about. Be like Amazon, congrats, you've unlocked free shipping. They're more likely to go buy. They can adjust their codes here. They can add other products on. So that's what's really gonna bring that average order value up. If you look here, average order value is $175 and they're getting 141 ROAS. So for every dollar they put in, they make $141 back. It's like a no brainer to keep scaling and growing your company. So that checkout page really needs to be optimized or you're gonna be missing out on a lot of sales. Also, you wanna think about your thank you page. You need to tell them what to do. So when they get to this page here, the offer, we're gonna tell them to go buy and watch the webinar and schedule a call and whatever else you think is gonna be relevant there. Um, here's an example on the webinar page, watch our webinar, but before they can actually get to the webinar, they watch this relationship video with this lady. What this does is build some trust, builds a better relationship to get to know the business. And the most important part, she tells them what to do next. Watch the webinar, check your email, get the coupon code, go to the product page. This is what to expect. So now you're building trust, you're building a relationship and you're telling someone what to do next. A lot of times people aren't just, aren't tech savvy. They might not even know what to do next. Tell them what to do next. It's gonna help them out and it's gonna take them from that cold flow here, cold, and it's gonna warm them up so they're more likely to buy. This is where we see some really cool results. If you guys have any questions about the landing pages, uh, higher conversions, make sure you stay to the end of the video where I give you these funnels, the appointment funnel, the e-commerce funnel, the checkout page funnel, and the email marketing funnel, where I break these down and dive even deeper. But you really need these high converting landing pages and the system or else you're just gonna be spinning your wheels. You have to get higher conversions 
You've got to tell them what to do. You've got to build relationships and you have to have that cool checkout page. All right, second thing is how to turn the cold into hot. Uh, and that's by communicating with them. And how can we communicate with them? Top two ways is email marketing. You can automate that and social media. That's where how you can really follow up with people, build better relationships over time. So here's a really cool uh, lead follow-up that we've implemented for this business. So as you can see, customer thank you. After somebody purchases or gets on that coupon code funnel, they've made $28,000. So that means I'll give you 10% off. If you give me your email, we're going to follow up with them and we're going to make 28,000. A welcome email. This is after somebody becomes a customer already. We're going to welcome them and ask for upsells, add-on products, 24,000. Customer win back. You can even get people that have canceled or stopped working with you in the past to come back and buy. So they've come back and bought $7,900 after they already canceled. And then last but not least is the abandoned cart, which we'll touch shortly. So we really need to have these systems in place. And this is where these sales funnels, this, these clients would not be successful if they didn't have these email marketing funnels set up. So number one, you can do some uh, demo calls. You know, if you're a higher ticket, if you're over $500 um, in sales, you might want to jump on a 15 minute demo with the, with your uh, leads. That way you can Zoom, I always recommend doing Zoom face to face, build that better relationship with them. And, um, and they're more likely to buy after that first call. Tell them to follow you on social media. So this is a really cool trick that we found on the first email when we give them the coupon code, we also ask them to follow you on social media, wherever you're the most active, so they see you all the time. So now they're getting your emails and they're seeing your social media posts. What better way to turn someone from cold to warm? And that's really our goal here with the Million Dollar Sales Funnel. How can we build better relationships with people? Turn them from a cold to a warm to a hot buyer. So that's a quick tip. Give them that coupon code, tell them to follow you on social. Now they're gonna get your emails and see you on social. In those email flows, we want to give them your best offer. So let's say you give them 10% or 20% off on this landing page, uh, whatever page it is here, give them the 10% and then follow up with an email a couple days later that gives them 50% off, whatever you can do, right? So this is what really will help you turn that person from uh, somebody from cold to warm. Abandoned cart. This isn't just for e-commerce. You can set up abandoned cart for um appointment or lead based businesses too so you know we're going to recommend some different software you can use i use member space for my memberships it automatically sends abandoned cart uh, for my course um sam cart for any type of business whether it's e-commerce or lead based it automatically sends abandoned cart so you spend all this money and time on your marketing and ads you get somebody to go all the way to your checkout page and get ready to buy and you're not even going to send them an email or you're only going to send them one. I would say 90% of businesses we work with only send one abandoned cart email. You've already spent all this time and money. You've got to at least send four, five, six abandoned cart emails to get them to come back. You work so hard to get them there. Why let them just leave? So abandoned cart needs to be for any type of business. And you need to ask them why they didn't buy. Remind them people are busy. You already know this. Just implement it. You need four or five emails after they abandon cart. Once they get to the end of this, your flow, keep following up. I've had people sign up with me three years after uh, reaching out the first time. So maybe they're not ready yet. Maybe they don't have the money yet. Maybe they're just not interested yet. Just keep following up with them at least once a month. So in three months, six months, 12 months, when they are ready, they'll come back to you. Now, this is a really complex email marketing funnel. Don't let it overwhelm you. Just set up at least one of these. So each row is a different funnel. So this is your 10% coupon page. This is your welcome email. Give them the coupon code, show them some reviews, give them FAQs, tell them about other products, and then give them 50% off if they didn't buy it. That's a really good one. Abandoned cart, get them on the checkout page, send them their product, give them an offer, free shipping, show them more reviews, and then send them an edgy email. Hey, why the heck didn't you buy? These email flows, if you can implement these, you're really going to see a change. You're going to see some of these numbers. $28,000 from emails, $24,000 from emails, $7,900. If your email flows look like this, you're going to make way more sales without having to spend more money on ads. And by the way, at the end of this uh, Dropbox folder, 
is our email sequence um, that you can actually copy and paste into your own system. It works really well. So I wanna encourage you guys to do that. All right, the last piece of the puzzle is your face gets you more customers. So just like I'm doing a face-to-face -face call with you now, I'm showing you how this works. This one video here, I would say has brought in most of our business. Um, and what it is, is I always say, what's the best way to build relationships with people? Face-to-face -face by shaking their hand, right? So what's the second best way? How can we shake someone's hand through the computer? And I think personalized videos, they don't have to be professional. They just have to be you. Now the personal style videos work because you're building a relationship. So when somebody's cold, never heard of automation links before, and they watch this video, they know my name, they know what we offer, and I tell them how they can work with us. That starts the relationship. Now you might be nervous or scared to make uh, videos, totally understand it. Took me six months to make my first video. Every morning I wake up, all right, today's the day, I'm making a video. I get all the way to the screen and I would exit out and do something different for six months. I finally made one, it was awful. Yours may be awful when you start, but they work. And I found a little trick, you'll find tricks as you practice. I make bullet points. So as you can see in this video, I've got a bullet point for every single thing I'm covering. If I can go bullet point by bullet point, I'm comfortable with that. And then I, since I'm an expert and I understand this and I have the knowledge, I can explain reading it. So put some, put three or four bullet points together. Make sure you hit each bullet point and describe each section. It works really well, builds better relationships. I even put my videos on our checkout pages. Before you buy with us, you'll see a video above it and I'm explaining exactly what you'll receive if you buy from us. Those videos are what will convert leads to buyers. I promise they work. You'll see on Amazon checkout pages, they're starting to include videos. What type of videos should you make? All kinds, whatever you're comfortable with. Mine are coaching. I really enjoy coaching people. Um, I actually have a coaching program and where I teach you all of this, but the coaching is what I really enjoy. So every week I make a YouTube coaching video where I just give you three tips and um, whatever I think is gonna help you and help with your business, I'll give you three tips on, my, on some free coaching. You can use, you can make FAQs, frequently asked questions. You can talk about case studies, some people you've worked with or reviews you, of people you've worked with. And if you really wanna get into it, you can start doing stories. Stories are on Instagram, Facebook, and YouTube now. And those are just some quick tips. You can just phone, hold your phone horizontal, give them one to three free tips and start getting your face out there. Now, remember when I said back up here, get them on your email list and ask them to follow you on social. So that's the trick here. They get on your email list. They start hearing from you on email. They saw your personal video on your landing page and on you asked them to follow you on social. Now on social, they start seeing your videos again. Videos are important. You don't have to make one every day. Make one at least once a month. Start with that and work up to once a week if you can. Another trick is really focus on YouTube videos if you can. I've got this YouTube video that's actually on Go on the first page of Google. And I made this two years ago, 2019, three years ago now, and I still get leads and customers from it. YouTube continues to grow as, as it sits there. As your YouTube videos sit there, you will keep getting more and more visitors and, and leads. So when you make these coaching videos, FAQs or case studies, put them on your, on your YouTube channel, add the links to your landing page, and put these videos on your landing pages. You're gonna keep getting visitors forever. It's a great way to follow up if they subscribe with you. You're gonna keep coaching and helping them, and it builds up your brand, just builds that better relationship. And that's the whole thing. This whole sales funnel thing is how to build better relationships with people, not just do marketing. It also increases conversions. Like I said, I put them on my checkout pages because now I'm gonna tell them exactly what they get if they pull out their credit card. If you wanna join my coaching program, I'm gonna show you a video telling you what you get if you join my coaching program. Super easy, but it works. It works really well. So just remember, I'll give you all um, access to this page so you can get all of these tips and start implementing them for your business. Now, I told you we come back to number one. After the system's in place, let's review. We wanna have a high converting landing page that loads super fast. We wanna give them your best offer. We wanna follow up with your best offer with a thank you page, telling them what to do. We wanna send them directly to the checkout page to buy, just in case they wanna buy. We wanna add them to your email marketing list. We wanna send at least six emails to follow up. And we need to have that really nice checkout page at all times here. 
Now, what about the marketing starting right here? Should I do Instagram? Should I do Facebook? Where should I do my marketing? Should I do ads? I want you to start organically first. The number one thing working right now that's bringing in amazing results is the Google My Business listing. Google knows that more and more people are using maps on their phone. So what they're doing is putting your Google My Business at the very top. Whether you're an e-commerce, a lead-based business, it doesn't matter. It, and the first thing I hear, first question I hear is I don't have an address. So if you're a local-based business, this makes sense, it's obvious. But if you are nationwide, you know people think that they can't do this. Well, guess what? We're nationwide, we're on Google My Business, and we get clients from it. Go put the postcard into your ad, home address, verify it, get rid of your address, and you can make it so it's nationwide. You'll start seeing visitors and leads right away. This business right here, 46,000 views last 30 days. 1,300 views last 30 days. 1,400 views last 30 days. They're skyrocketing without doing anything. 11,000 views last 30 days. And this is the coolest one, 111,000 views in the last 30 days. It's frequent, it's outrageous. The results are amazing. And without doing anything, you're gonna get more views. You're always gonna be in the green, always gonna be going up in views. Uh, and that's even before promoting it. So what I do is I go and add these videos to it, add your post to it, add pictures to it, just like you would post on Instagram or Facebook, copy and paste that and put it up. These views will continue to go up and you will get more leads and customers. Quick tip, change the website link that you send people to, to your landing page to get even more conversions. So th these clients right here, we send them all to the landing page to get that 10% coupon code. That is actually the most important marketing tactic working right now. Put your landing page links in your Google My Business and you will get results. That If you want results with us, that's the first thing we would do. Set that up and it'll work. If you're e-commerce, you wanna get set up on Google Shopping, let's take a quick look. What's the very first thing that Google shows you? Shopping results. Now these are ads, you can pay to be here and then you also have free listings here. So if you're an e-commerce business, you need to be on Google Shopping today and you wanna make sure these reviews show. I would buy this one, these two over this one any day because this one doesn't have reviews. These look way better. Google wants to be better than Amazon. So what they're doing is taking Google Shopping, put it at the top of the newsfeed, promoting it and getting you sales. It goes directly to your website. So e-commerce, focus on Google Shopping. Lead-based business, focus on YouTube videos and Google My Business. Those are the two pieces working the most right now for all of our clients. It's working really well. If you wanna really dig into it and you start making videos, the stories really go a long way. We got Instagram, Facebook stories, and even YouTube stories now. Make some FAQs, quick tips of the day, and make sure you send people to your landing page because we know the landing page converts. Don't send them to your website. So those are some quick tips. I want you to implement those if you can. Let me know your results. Let me know if you've already been doing Google My Business. Um, these businesses we work with are, and it's just really incredible to see the results. Last but not least is you can start scaling with ads, but not until your system's set up. So I want you to have that system set up first, test it organically, test it on Google My Business, your social media channels, make sure everyone's going through this flow, make sure your emails are set up correctly, which you'll see at the bottom here. And then from there, then you can start scaling with ads. So we really recommend Google ads to get your traffic in there. Google shopping ads, like I showed you, you can be right here at the top, Google shopping if you're e-commerce. Um, Google map ads, so those clients here that I was showing you, we put them at the number one spot in Google maps. Um, so they show up, we know 111,000 people, number one on Google maps, and they go to the landing page to get 10% off. It works, it brings in some cool results. Um, and then from there, you can really start doing your retargeting. So I want your system in place first, but what's cool is when they get on your email list and you start following up with them on email, you ask them to follow you on social, now they should start seeing your, your Facebook and Instagram ads as a retargeting, just like if you looked at shoes. So this would be the last step of the puzzle is to really start pushing those ads. And the, if you wanna get money back right away, we talk about ROAS. Um, for every dollar you spend, how much you get back. You really want those retargeting ads to go towards the cold buyers that have already been to your landing page. So anyone that comes to your landing page, follow up with an ad and an email, and then that turns them to warm to hot. 
All right, um, you'll see some ads from us on our ad account here. So, and I only show these to people that have already been to our landing page. So what they do is they come to the landing page and then the next day they see my video, showing them the same thing they saw on the landing page, just as a reminder. Show them some results, show them some stats, show them the funnel a different way. So when you start doing ads and they hit your landing page, you've got seven to 15% signing up, follow up with the rest and remind them to come back. Works really, really well. If you have any questions about that, make sure you leave me a comment and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. And that's just taking it to a whole nother level. All right, I wanna invite you to join my relationship marketing course. So this is working, you can come in here, get to my free access. The sales funnels are free. And what I want you to do is come check out these top four. These are the best performing ones. So check, if you're a lead-based business, check out the appointment funnel. If you're e-commerce, get the e-commerce funnel. Um, and then check out the checkout funnel. That's where I show you the Amazon pages that work really well, like I showed you earlier. And then the email marketing funnel. Um, that way you can see exactly what those emails say, what software to use, et cetera. If you're interested in the course, I'd love to have you part of it. Um, I'll show you how to get more conversions, more sales, increase your average order value, increase leads, tell you exactly what software to use. If you're using MailChimp, you're probably missing out on a lot. Um, so I'd recommend you switch from MailChimp to our recommended ones. Um, if you have a course, I'll show you which course software to use. If you have e-commerce, I'll show you how to, all the software to increase the average order value. And I'll even teach you the video and social media marketing that has helped grow automation links. And last but not least, we are going to continue adding on for scaling with ads. We're going to show you the Google ads, the Facebook ads, the retargeting ads, the YouTube ads, everything you need to scale. So this will be coming every single week, a new lesson here. Would love to have you. And I'll give you 50% off. It's my best offer, right? Just like I talked about. Use coupon code 2022 on this link when you get into this page. Um, last but not least, you're going to see our email sequence here. Copy and paste this into your email marketing software and plug it into your landing page. So a couple different things to review. This landing page works. The sales funnel works. Um, it's seeing some great results. I want you to focus on the system first. I want you to make a really nice checkout page with the software we recommend. I want you to add our high converting emails and then go through, make some social media posts, set up Google My Business listing and see what people do. Start doing some testing. See if they get to the order form. See if they reply back to any of your emails. And then you can start running the ads and really starting to push this. But make sure your system's in place if you want these type of results. Thanks again for watching. Uh, thanks for jumping on here. Um, hopefully my volume worked this time. It didn't work last time. Under the video in the comments um, or in the description, I'm going to give you this link um, to the paper Dropbox. Just sign in with Dropbox. You can have full access to it. And make sure you scroll down here to get those six emails. These work. These are the exact emails we use for automation links. And just builds better relationships with people. And that's what I want to encourage you all. How can you build better relationships with your potential customers through videos, landing pages, emails? Please start doing it. You will start seeing some great results. Thanks again for watching, and I will talk to you soon.